Hello and welcome to the Biddeford College Careers Team video. In this video I'll give you lots of information which will help you choose your GCSE options. I'm Miss Woodhall and I work alongside Mr Hardy as part of your careers team here at Biddeford College. We are located in Office G3B and can often be found in the Careers Hub in G3A. It's my job to provide you with lots of impartial information and experiences about education, training and jobs, so you can be confident when choosing the right options for you. There is a huge amount of career support for you to access at school. A few of the things I organise are workshops and presentations with employers, trips and workplace experiences, one-to-one -one guidance appointments, drop-in careers clinics and our annual careers fair. You can also borrow books from the careers section in the library and use the resources in the careers hub, such as College Prospectus and Careers Pilot. So you're in year nine and about to choose your GCSE options. Choosing the subjects you'll be studying for the next two years is your first big decision towards planning for your future when leave bidder for college. You might be really excited or you might be really worried and that's totally okay. There are loads of people around you to help. You will need to start thinking about what you might like to do when you get to the end of year 11. If you know, that's great. You need to look at what subjects you're going to need to choose in order to progress along your pathway. If you don't know, that's okay too. You need to choose subjects that will give you plenty of choice later on. If you're thinking you might want to go to university, some degrees will require prior learning in certain subjects. Often the best idea is to start by looking at the degree requirements and then the A-level entries and then choose your GCSEs to meet them. Lots of careers and courses after year 11 do not have specific subject requirements. So how do you choose? It's important that you choose options that interest and motivate you. You're more likely to succeed if you enjoy your lessons. Some good reasons for choosing subjects would be that you're good at it and that you enjoy it. Your teachers might have also told you that you're good at the subject and that you're really good at what it involves. Some bad reasons for choosing subjects might be that your friend is choosing the subject and you have no interest in it. It also might be that someone else wants you to do the subject, even though you don't really want to. It could be that you like the teacher who's currently teaching you, but often you'll get a different teacher for GCSE. What careers could your options lead on to? You're lucky here at Biddeford as you have so many wonderful subjects to choose from and these can lead to some amazing career opportunities. By getting GCSEs in the core subjects, it opens up a huge range of possibilities to you at the end of year 11. By studying languages or geography, you could travel the world. By studying history or drama, you could design costumes for the famous. By studying business or food, you could be the next Michael Keynes. You are taking your first steps on a pathway that can lead you to any career you can dream of. There will be some of you who like the idea of being more practical or maybe enjoy doing more coursework. These subjects can lead into further study such as A-levels, apprenticeships, T-levels, traineeships and other vocational qualifications. If you know that you want to get into certain industries, for example construction or hair and beauty, taking a level two is a good step along your pathway to achieving this. To choose your GCSEs, research, research and research. Read your options booklet. Watch the subject videos on the school website. Speak to your tutors and your teachers. And you can use Careers Pilot to research what careers you could have in different subjects. 
Browse books and resources in the Library and Careers Hub and you can always visit me for support. Choose what is important to you. Do not let your gender or your friends dictate your choices. Construction and engineering, for example. Both men and women have really successful careers in this industry. Hair and beauty. There are many experienced and very famous hairdressers that are male. Make sure that you choose the options that you have an interest in. You do you. The careers team have been working very hard since September to put in place lots of different events and activities for you. So get involved. There's after school club on a Monday where we invite employers to come in and speak to you in the library. This is a lovely informal way for you to be able to meet them and ask any questions you may have. I run a careers drop in during break one in G3B where you are welcome to pop in and ask me any questions that you may have and if you need any further support. We also have the careers fair coming up on February the 17th where you're invited along with your parents and your guardians to come and visit all the employers, volunteers and education and training providers that we have invited to the school to speak to you. If you need any further support or you can think of any questions, please do come and visit. Thank you.